Hey guys, KT here. Welcome back to some more Mafia. We are where we are currently progressing on forward. After uh, we walked home Luigi's daughter Sarah, but after a bunch of guys decided to harass her, uh, we're now given a chance to make it very clear to not fuck with her again. So we're gonna go ahead and talk to Vin uh, Vincent. Vincent. We're just gonna call him Vince, honestly. Hey. hey. Here for some heaters, Tom. Nah, I'm already going and healed. Paulie and me, we gotta give a beating to some punks that've been on our turf. I don't want to pull this and piss in our own street. There's something to bust heads. That's all we need. Sam turned over some guy's warehouse and uh, autographed by Babe Ruth himself. The guy said, "I mean, that's horseshit, but they bust heads." The punks won't have time for questions. No, they won't. Thanks, Vinny. Can I just say, I love the change in, uh, in the outfits for, uh, <laughs> for Tommy. Can we talk about that? The fact that, uh, we're just changing, it's like showing the progression of, uh, how we are, how we're progressing through the, through the mob. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead. We're going to try out the uh, Schubert. That looks like a good car, so I might as well give it a shot. Turn off that radio. We don't want copyright here. Because uh, I actually do not want strikes on my channel. Uh, because I don't I don't know. Sometimes music's always hit or miss. No one's ever, like... I, I think I've only had one claim to, like, footage. And it was via cutscene for our... Uh, Black Ops 3. I'm gonna be. I think it. I. I had that. Other than that. Okay, I didn't even have the limiter on. Okay, that explains why I'm having a little bit of inconsistency with my control. Shit. Okay. Let's just keep going ahead. I see the cops went a whole different direction, which is fine with me. Just gotta ma meet Polly real quick. That's all that matters. I think we're gonna have to deal with Polly's uh, whole thing with uh, causing issues with that one uh, one D one person over here. Finger fingers crossed we don't. About time. Come on, I'm wet through. Why Biff moved into this dump? I'll never know. Give him a break. He's in love. Uh, he's got yellow fever that time we boosted the Shanghai skin flicks. Well, I like her anyways. Problem with you, Tom, you always soft with the dames. I, I love that thought process with Polly. Alright, here we go. Let's see what we got in store for us. Biff, you fat bastard. What are you doing? Chut mouth, no team. They tell all they team. Don't they fun to soil your team by touch her like? Dog face, great to see ya. Call her off, Biff. We got business. Upstairs. Please. So, what's the beef? Need some information. Got some jokers causing trouble. They messed with Luigi's daughter. Plenty of hoods around. You got any more? One of them's a weasel named Billy. Pals with a prissy chump and a bruiser with a bald head. Right, right. I know him. They're set up in the old service station a block over. They hock some gear every now and then, in the small time. <laughs> That's why I knew to come to you, Biff. You're good with small time. Out the back, cross the street. You'll find them there. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Polly. Uh, about that dough? Relax. Just waiting for my guy to come through. It'll be next week. Just sit tight. All right. And we got Detectives Magazine. Love it. <gasps> Polly, why'd you scream? What was that back there? You and Biff got something going on. Guy I know is bringing in a shipment of suits. Class ones, Mexico. We getting suits from Mexico? No, idiot. The suits are boosted from a lockup downtown. The tailor is from Mexico. Originally, anyways, he lives in Holbrook. Did Don know about this? Yeah, yeah, he'll get his cut. You just keep this under your hat. I guess I heard nothing. You gonna know these punks when you see them? Yeah. Though, 
I guess if I don't, all we gotta do is find the other guys in Chinatown who look like we do. There it is. I feel like these guys are gonna run as soon as we come up. Not gonna lie. Here's how we do this. I walk in and start beating. Do the same. No shooters. You take long thinking that one up. Nah, this plane gets used a lot. I think we gotta go in through the side. I just love how Polly just brings up what we were already planning on doing anyway. Wasn't even gonna plan on shooting him, unless a gun gets brought up. Then I might, but we'll see. Tony the nicest ass I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> yo, yo. Oh, Billy, it's the guy from the other night. We gotta go. <laughs> Oh, are they gonna run now? Come get him. Right. Get out really? Out Me over here expecting that we're gonna have to uh, run. But nope, we're just gonna beat the hell out of some punks. That's fine. Apparently the... Oh shit, you brought a knife to a baseball bat fight, man? Nah, we ain't doing that. Fuck out of here. I don't... I love how... If they're swinging at the same time I do, mine automatically misses. Can we talk about that? It's kind of fucked up. I love how I can't sprint. Okay, I gotta remember why every time I need to do it. Here we go. Damn, I caused a lot of destruction for no reason. Okay, I gotta remember the controls when it comes to op uh, doing certain tasks. I always think it's something else. All right, let's do it. Wait, Polly. Over here made me think I, I, I'm hit, shooting an enemy just to find out. Oh no, it's Polly. Hold on, what's over here? I probably shouldn't be so nonchalant with how I'm acting right now. Because I'm not even, like, trying. Hold on. What is that symbol on my map? Is it inside? Am I just being stupid? Hold up. Oh, man. I really hope uh, there's a way to heal. Fuck. Okay, yeah, yeah. There's, uh... Some heels over there. What's over here, though? Okay, it's on the other side of the other side. All right, here we go. Let's pick that up. Thank you. Heal up before I go into more fight. Too used to games with auto heals anymore. What do you mean we started? You uh. Or wait, was that Polly talking? Now that I think about it, it might have been Polly talking. Where's the last guy? Ah, there you are. Get on their sight. All right, what's this over? Here? Oh, Motovs. Okay, that makes sense. I was like, what the fuck is with all this shit over here? Okay, then we got a collectible. Cool, cool, cool. Ah, and I if I just tap LB, it just switches automatically. I love it. Yeah, you guys aren't too good with the uh, running and stabbing part. Johnny, get down! Oh, come on, come on. Get out of here! Shit, we gotta get to a car, Tom! Scram! Come on, we can't move! 
There we go, get my gun out. Make it a little uh, more fun. Here we go, here we go. Go careful, Tom. The road's a river. Don't worry, I can Oh shit. It. More of these guys. We actually have some issues here. I love it. I don't think I can shoot them. I think it's just gonna lead to them crashing or leading us to their base. One of the one of the two, we'll figure that out. Come on, this can't be too big of an issue. I would say the auto lock ain't kicking on, so. Ever seen guys piss their pants this quick? If you look through the rain, you can see it dripping out the back of their car. Oh, so we did hit something. Cool. Looks like that's the last of them. Last of who? I, we only had one guy. Come on, come on. We can't I know, I know, Polly. Calm down. I'm aware. These guys are going to regret they ever set eyes on Sarah, huh? I love how Polly's trying to talk to me as we're chasing these guys down. Love it. Man, I really wish this was my car. This car goes a little too slow. I know, Polly. Car's going slow. They think they're gonna get away, huh? They ain't seen you drive like I have. What are these guys? Come on, come on! We can't let him get away. Dumb son of a bitch just wrecked himself. Well, they're not walking away from that. I want to pop and pop. No. No, no, wait. Please. Please, I don't want to fucking die, man. Christ, Tom. You can't feel sorry for these animals. A guy like this would plug you if you give him the chance. You gotta pull the trigger without thinking. I'm out. This one's finished too. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> mm. Oh Christ, Tom. Snap out of it. You remember what those guys wanted to do to Sarah? Yeah, just, uh... Hey, let's get out of here before the bulls show up, huh? When a bunch of, uh, breaking bones go straight to firing... Jeez, you know, I understand where, uh, Tom was coming from, though. Like, I, you know, he was beg he was over here begging for his life, like... All we were told was to break bones. It wasn't even them who was shooting us. It was all of his buddies. But, uh, I, I guess it, you know, Polly had a point, so. Let's see what we got next. Hopefully this doesn't affect my relationship with Sarah. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Waiting for the game to load at this point. Okay. Simple straight. Oh. I can't afford this life no more. Just getting lucky. I'll give you a chance to win your money back. You want in, boss? We have business to discuss, Paulie. We're in it now, boys. One of our associates at the coroner's office sent this over. Corpse's name is Giolotti. You recognize him? Sure. That's one of the punks we ran out of the neighborhood. Now he got the bullet in the back of his head? Yeah. We tapped him. Well, the cops ought to thank us. We did him a favor. The guy was a rapist, boss. Yeah? Well, he was also a city councilor's son. You want to drive a politician into Morello's arms? 
There's no better way than killing off his family. Oh, Christ. That gets worse. You left another guy in the wreck? Yeah, but he was dead when we got there. You gonna tell me he was the president's nephew or something? Two in the head, Pauly. If you're gonna do a job, do it right. He made it? Yes. He spent the week in St. Mary's, but he pulled through. <sighs> Can he point a finger at either of you? I don't know. Maybe. Okay. Look. We're gonna kill two birds with one blast. Galati's funeral's today at St. Michael's. Sam, you're gonna attend. Sit in the back and try to spot the lucky bastard. How will I recognize him? He'll be the one who just crawled away from a car wreck. His arm is broken. Look for a sling. Sam's gonna need a little distraction if he's gonna clean up your mess. Are you sending Tommy to dip his wick? It's a brothel? A gentleman's club, just down the street from St. Michael's. Madonna's invested a lot of money in it over the years. So, me and Sam. Regardless, the owner has suddenly decided to do business with Morello instead of us. You want me to go remind him of his obligations? Yes. Then blow the place up. What? Morello wants to take businesses away from us? He'll inherit craters. Look, Tom, we can't send Paulie and Sam since all the ladies know them already. They'd never make it through the front door. But you can walk right in. Okay. What about the manager? Take care of him wherever you find him. If any of the horse see it, well, it'll be a warning. Once he's out of the way, head to his office on the top floor. Grab any documents or money you find there and place the explosives. Vincenzo will see that you have what you need. And you think the blast will be big enough to give me cover? Yeah. But be smart. Only take a shot if you know you won't get me. Tommy, one more thing. One of the girls is passing Morello information about our operations. Before you blow the place, you'll need to take care of her, too. You want Tommy to kill a twist? Come on, Frank. It's just bad luck this falls to town. But we gotta protect the family. Her name is Michelle. She's usually working one of the upper rooms. Her photo is in the folder. You boys clear on everything? Yeah. Tom. I got it, boss. Then get it done. Damn. All right, well, guys, we're going to go ahead. We're going to end it here. If you enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe, check out all the links in the description below. It really helps out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.